Hey there, listeners. Alvin here, coming to you from Green Ground News. Today, we're diving deep, and I mean deep, into a story that's been buzzing around the tech world. Picture this. Two of the biggest names in tech, Elon Musk and Mark Zuckerberg, in a sounds like something out of a movie, right? Let's break it down. Now, I've seen my fair share of tech battles, but this, this is something else. Mark Zuckerberg, the genius behind Meta, for merely Facebook, recently took to the Threads blogging platform. And guess what he said? I love this sport and I've been ready to fight since the day Elon challenged me. Oh, and he added a little zinger, hinting that we should be skeptical of Musk's claims until we hear it from him. Classic Zuckerberg move, always playing it cool. But Musk, our audacious dreamer, isn't one to be outdone. He's painting a picture of an epic showdown set against the backdrop of ancient Rome. He's even claimed to have chatted with Italy's top brass about securing an iconic location. And the cherry on top? The fight's proceeds are set to benefit veterans. Now that's a twist I didn't see coming. But here's the kicker, folks. Just when we thought this showdown was imminent, Musk drops a health bombshell. An MRE, a potential surgery, and a few months of recovery. Now, I'm no doctor, but that sounds like this match might be on the back burner for a bit. So, what's the takeaway here? This isn't just about a physical duel. It's a symbolic clash of tech titans. Musk with his boundary, pushing dreams, and Zuckerberg with his strategic evolution. If this match happens, it's not just about who throws the better punch. It's about determination, resilience, and the art of captivating an audience. Listeners, I don't know about you, but I'm on the edge of my seat. Will we see this epic face off, or will it remain the stuff of legends? Only time will tell. But one thing's for sure. In the world of tech, expect the unexpected. That's all from me today. This is Alvin from Green Ground News, signing off. Stay curious and keep questioning.